Hey guys, on today's tutorial I'm going to teach you how to convert your PDF even images that you took with your phone into text so you can import that to Word or InDesign, whatever you're going to do with it. Anyways, um, first I'm going to show you right away if let's say you took a screenshot or just have a picture of the text you want to convert just open it up okay so it's gonna open up with preview so make sure it's opened up with preview it's easy it's free uh, preview comes built in with your Mac so you're fine and then you want to save it so this is just the picture that I have for example uh, you want to go into file and just export as PDF okay so once you export this as a PDF and you can open it up okay and you want to open it up this time with Adobe Acrobat Pro okay and here it is so this is another file that I have so it has a lot of text so I can show you guys um the optimal thing that you want is not something like this exactly see right here it's kind of blurry-ish so this will this text right here won't be converted that well and we're gonna have to fix that so it's actually easier to rescan your stuff that you just um, scan than to fix this manually okay but in this case let's say we don't have a choice and we have to convert this into text to using InDesign or Word so um, just go into tools okay so that's right here so once you're in tools we're gonna go down into in this file okay so recognize text in this file we're gonna click on there from there you're gonna guys see all this stuff okay so what I suggest doing um, we're gonna do all pages in this document it's gonna take a while make sure to be running only one program at a time or else it's gonna be a little bit laggy like right now you see on my screen it's a little bit laggy because I'm running other programs but uh, this takes a lot so just make sure to be running one program at a time when you're doing this okay unless you're just doing one page then it's fine um, something you want to go is to edit under edit um, what I like to do is click on clear scan it just comes out a little bit better um, 600 dpi you want the highest as you can go maybe it won't let you go there 300 is just fine 600 is just better okay um, it'll detect the words a lot better okay um, apart from that you just click OK and then it's gonna start doing its thing okay so you're gonna see this right down here the process so right now it's doing page one um, some pages you might have them upside down such as this one and that one it's gonna flip it by itself okay so it's gonna correct that issue so it will detect that the page is the wrong side it will flip it over and correct the text okay once again parts that have blurry ish parts it will not do such a good job there um, for special characters if, if you have like text over another page of text kind of mixed in there it, it's not gonna convert that either that well so but for huge parts of text that are easy to read um, those it's gonna convert it just fine okay um, also if it's a PDF that's uh, not scanned by you maybe you download it off the net and maybe it's uh, an original PDF which is not a scanned version um, this doesn't do such a good job at converting your text okay however if you scan something yourself from a magazine let's say such as this sample right here it's gonna be much better detecting all the text that it has to detect from there all you have to do is highlight the text that you want to um, transfer to Word uh, of course from here in Acrobat you can also save it as a Word file um, I don't suggest doing that I, I find it easier to just highlight the text copy paste onto a word file or InDesign if you're using InDesign and that's it so this will take some time to correct everything you're gonna see how it, it doesn't really focus on the images itself it will focus more most on text um, when you pick the options that I showed you you can try other options if you need the pictures as well um, but this is more focused on text anyways guys if you guys have any problems questions you can write them here below and don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you